Hello, my name is Mr. Dog, and today we're going to be looking at the Tyranitar V deck. This guy has a pretty good attack, single strike crash, which does 240 damage. Now, you may be thinking that the attack cost is a little bit awkward, and you'd be right, which is why we play four copies of Dark Patch, which lets us attach a basic energy card from our discard pile to one of our bench Pokemon, and three max elixirs. And we also play double colorless energy. If you want to do more than 240 damage, we have Choice Band, which lets us do 30 more damage to our opponent's Pokemon EX and Pokemon GX. We also have Single Strike Energy, which lets us do 20 more damage to any of our opponent's Pokemon. And we have Karen's Conviction, which lets us do 20 more damage for each prize card our opponent has taken. It can potentially do 100 extra damage. Finally, we have Shrine of Punishment, which puts one damage counter on each Pokemon GX and Pokemon EX each turn. So that wraps up the introduction, let's get into some gameplay. Okay, so here we are, we had to start off with the Crobat, so we can start off with the Tyranitar on the bench. We do get a double colorless energy first turn, which is pretty nice. And I think we'll get a dark energy in the discard pile. Dene is probably the best thing to do. Honestly. Um, need to try and get like a dark patch or something. Okay, perfect. Um, sadly, we can't attack this turn because we don't have like floatstone or anything, but that's okay. Um, we can attack next turn. And we'll just pass for now. Um, this is this can evolve into Incineroar, but you'd need like a rare candy for that. So we're getting Marnie. So that's honestly fine. Because I need to find a floatstone. We don't get it, but we can end next turn, so it's okay. So he does 20 damage. Oh no, 20 damage. So bad. Okay. I guess we'll use the max elixir. See if we get lucky. Nice. And I might as well get... I might as well get another Tyranitar. Just so I can start building that up. Just to be on the safe side. Honestly, I think I'll attach to the Crobat. And it gets the energy in the discard pile as well. So, yeah. I might not even end this turn, honestly. No, I think we have to because I need more cards. And we've got a double colorless for next turn as well. Um, so let's just see if we get lucky off this. We don't, but it's okay. Um, we can attack with Craglanch, make him discard some cards. See what we get off the prize cards. Energy, that's nice. Um, if he gets the uh, the VMAX for this, then that wouldn't be too good. Mm. We can we can retreat with the Floatstone, so we don't get knocked out with Word of Ruin, so it'll be not too bad. Yeah, and Cineral, okay. So we can actually knock that out if we get our boss's orders. Oh, he's gonna. I think he's gonna attack with that. Maybe to discard my energy. Maybe I don't know. I need to be careful about that GX attack though, because the more energy he get, the more damage he gets on himself, the more damage it does. He has a Greninja and Zoroark. Okay. Um, so I need to stop him getting a load of energy out because he does 30 da more damage for each energy he gets out. He can only do 170 with that, with the GX attack so far. Okay. So I need to find a float stone so I don't get knocked out. I might, might as well attach this to here. So I'll discard... I'll discard an energy and rescue stretcher. And we'll get a float shrine of punishment so we can start doing some damage to his GXs. And I won't bother getting a special energy. Put that down. So... 
put that down. Hopefully we've got a Dedenne in the deck. Okay, perfect. So all Dedenne. I just need some Dark Patches and a Max Elixir. Okay, there's a Max Elixir. Um, hopefully we'll get lucky off this. Okay, perfect. And I need a, a Dark Stone, a Dark Patch off this. Karen and Ultra Ball. Please tell me the Dark Patch isn't prized. Okay, but no it isn't. Cool. So there we go. We will discard some of our own cards, but it's a price worth paying, I think. And we'll start to do some damage to his um, Greninja and Zoroark. So we can potentially knock it out at some point. We might get knocked out of by the Incineroar though. Oh no, it's only doing... Oh no, I think he just about knocks us out. If he does the uh, Scar charge, maybe. But will he do that though? He might not do that. Or he might attack with this one. Matty asked TCG, I wonder if this guy's a YouTuber. He might be. So he's getting more energy onto this, this one. He might just attack with the Greninja and Zoroark. But if he does, I can just knock it out the next turn. So I don't know. That might not be the best move. He could do a lot of things, to be honest. Okay, he's just going to use his GX attack, that's fine. Um, I think we just take the knockout. Is there really anything else I want to do? I don't think so. Like I could just maybe I could boss onto the, onto his Greninja and Zoroark because after that point you can't do much damage with you only do 130 damage so yeah that's probably the best thing to do so I'll I'll get a Tapu Lele oh crap a Tapu Lele is prize damn it okay so I'll have to Cynthia then that's unfortunate. So we'll take the knockout. We're getting pretty low on cards, which is quite scary. So choice band. Dark patch. Okay. So we can attack next turn. Because we have the switch as well. I just hope we don't get End or Marnie to that kind of suck. He will probably knock this out, but it doesn't matter. Actually, he might not knock it out. He might not have enough energy. He's only got six, so he'll do... He'll... Okay, I think he might just have enough. Six times equal 180. Yeah, okay, he's definitely going to have enough. That's probably all of his energy out of the deck. Okay, so I think we just win the game then. It was very close. So we'll we'll use we'll use the dark patch to get energy onto this Tyranitar. And then attach double colorless. And then we switch for the knockout. GG my friend. Very close. Oh, and no cards left as well. Okay, so against the Shadow Rider Dragapult, which is pretty cool because they're both weak to darkness. Um, so I think we want to discard an energy and a boss's orders. If we discard an energy, we can just get it right back on this Tyranitar with the dark patch. So that's pretty cool. And um, we'll attach the bench because... Yeah, we can we can use Max Elixir and Dark Patch on here. 
and potentially get a float to attack, which would be nice. Um, right. So maybe we can get a double dragon, not a double colorless energy next turn. I think we'll just pass. Hopefully we don't get Marnied. We can also get a float with this, so we can retreat. And hopefully he upgrades into the Dragapult VMAX, because if he does, we can just knock it out and take three prize cards, which would be pretty good. This isn't this is, isn't weak to darkness, though. It's weak to fighting. Uh, it's also single strike. Um, we, we potentially get knocked out if we don't retreat. He plays Max Elixir as well. Interesting um, deck. Lots of new Chilling Rain cards. Right, so we can just get the knockout on this Dragapult right here. Discard. Um, probably discard the Switch because I don't need it and the Darkness Energy. In case I need to use another Dark Patch, probably get Double, dra double Colorless and the Float Stone. So we'll attach there. And then retreat. And then we can just get the knockout right here. Hopefully we don't discard anything too important. Uh, we discarded the boss and an energy. It's okay, we can just get the boss back with a V Seeker if we need to. That's why we play three V Seekers. And there's a Max Elixir, nice. So we can potentially start powering up this Tyranitar if it gets knocked out. If this one gets knocked out. Is this the one? It puts three damage counts on you if you attack it, I believe. But it's not that big of a deal, in all fairness. If we had a boss, we could maybe target this. Okay, now we can't because we couldn't knock it out in one hit. But uh, So we'll just start powering up the one on the bench for now. Nice, we got an energy. And another energy. Oh yeah, you, oh no, it's free damage counters if you attach an energy, right, okay. I will just attack. Um, right. So we just got us in the Dedenne, which is really bad, but we can potentially get it back with the rescue stretcher, so it's not the end of the world. What else did we discard? Oh no, we discarded two bosses! No! Okay. So we need a V-Seeker so we can boss onto this Shadow Rider Calyrex and knock it out. It shouldn't be too hard. Um, I haven't used any V-Seekers yet, so... I only got 27 cards yet. So I'm pretty confident we can get it. I could do a float though, so this doesn't get knocked out. Hey, I play Shrine of Punishment as well. I'm not playing any GXs at the moment, so it's not really going to affect me. So I just need a V-Seeker. We could thin out the deck a little bit. Um, what do we want to discard? I probably don't need another Battle Compressor. And I probably don't need a Shrine of Punishment. Discard these for now, that's probably fine. Uh, we'll attach this here. Put down another Tyranitar just to be on the safe side. I might as well get a Dene from here. Hopefully we can find the V-Seeker to win the game. Sadly we don't get it, um, but we can do a little bit of damage onto this guy. Um, we can start powering up this Tyranitar as well. So I may as well do that. Um, so that's two energy already. Um, do you wanna... I don't see much point in... I'll just use this to get rid of it out of the deck, I guess. Get rid of those two. And then we'll... Bruno. See if we can find that V-Seeker for next turn. Alright, so we can V-Seeker with this. Um... Need to be careful we don't run out of cards. You might just retreat anyway. We might not even need the boss's orders, honestly. I'm just thinking if he has like a, a weakness guard or something and he retreats. I don't know why he's putting a wishful baton on there because if I knock it out, he's lost the game anyway, so he's not gonna have a chance to transfer the energy. Togekiss? What kind of deck is this? This is very weird. 
Okay, yeah. GG. I hope you enjoyed this video and please remember to like, comment and subscribe. It would really help out my channel. And I'll see you for the next lecture case. Bye!